Hey everybody, welcome back to Chaos Gate. Demon Hunters, Dan here with No Games for Old Men. We are fresh off our victory against Munificus the Undying, whose reports of being undying are exaggerated. He is no more, but we can't rest. We've already got trouble brewing here on the planet of Kerman 5. Level 4 Dolorous infection happening here. Threatening to go to 5, which would then trigger a flowering mission, so we want to prevent that. So as exhausted as the Grey Knights are, they must continue the fight. Not an attuned planet, so we don't know who we're facing. We do know that there are at least six Dolorous Seeds, though. Destroy the Bloom Spawn Spreader to earn two requisition. If we go with a glorious deed of winning the mission without mastercrafted melee weapons, we can earn one extra requisition. I might do that. Mission rewards will get a requisition anyway. Reduce corruption by one, so that'll go down to three. And we've got some tier three items available here for us. We've got some equipment, some armor, and a storm bolter. That's all very cool. So let's start this mission. Good news is that Inquisitor Vakir is no longer uh, suffering from her injuries from the Noctil of the Crown mission, so we have our stratagems back. We had stratagems back in our last mission, so this is not, <laughs> this is not news for, for us, but okay. So Iolanthus, he is injured. So I think I'm going to swap him for another another leader. So I think that'll be Agrivald Dekren, our chaplain. We'll get him in the fight. And we need to swap out his melee weapon for a basic. Standard issue Crozius, so that we can get that... Valor deed. Stormbolter. Aurelian's Verdict. Okay, we can upgrade this. Let's see, do we have the seeds? Yeah, we've got 17 of these seeds. I think we can upgrade this. The side bolt will do an extra point of damage. So, Dekrin, then we're going to be using him from a distance a little bit since his melee weapon has been reduced in effectiveness. Although, we are going to still give him the Domina Liber Demonica, I think. Unless we give him, hang on, hold the phone. What if we give him, uh, we could give him a skull, we give him the extractor skull. Where's my extractor skull? There's my extractor skull. Yeah, let's do that. Usually I have my squad leader with that anyway, so that'll be, that'll be a good replacement. Armor, Terminator armor. He's got basic Terminator armor. This is, this is not not great. If I swap him with for Scholar's Acuity, I think yeah, Iolanthus had that. So let's give him the Scholar's Acuity. I've got it fully upgraded. Lots of extra armor, four extra willpower. That gets him up to eleven. So that's great. We're gonna be able to use him, use his abilities once I figure out. How to do it. I still don't feel like I've got a good handle on the chaplain. Healing. Apothecary Dekrin took some big hits in that fight against the Reaper. So we're going to swap him for... Who do, we, who do we want? Who do we want? Well, the only other option of uh, un uninjured Apothecary... Yikes. It's casual. casual. So, okay, Cajulon. What's he got in ranged? Oh boy. Forgiveness, see. Just a car. Alright, what do I have? My uh, Aurelian's Verdict No, Derek's Bolter. Yeah, alright, let's go with let's go with the forgiveness. We'll just have to find a suitable tier three item weapon for Iolanthus to carry full time. Melee. He's already got the. Oh, no, he does not. Excuse me. Alright, let's give him the life giver. 
We're just going to be swapping that back and forth with our apothecaries until I get a better one. Power armor. Okay. Let's see. He's got a tier 1 power armor right now. I've got a tier 3 not even being used right now. He's got focus bonus. Health bonus. That would be useful because he's, he's at 18. He's only at rank 5. Okay. What autos does he have? None. None. So, giving him a focus boost armor would not be useful. The extra health would be useful. The extra move speed would be useful. Extra willpower would be useful. Look at that. So, maybe I do that anyway? Sacred Incense and a Medicaid Skull. Yeah, th those are good. So, let's, let's pause on the armor for him. This is a... No, this is a melee weapon, so I have to give him the basic one. If I'm going to go for the Valor Deed. Drag. Okay. Storm. Look who's back. Basque, Varn, and Rugen. They have all returned from their special mission. Uninjured. So, maybe we make some use of them. Um, Basque? Basque. We have not, this is a purifier. This is a, a special, a new class we haven't, we haven't used yet. So, he's got Song of Purity, Incinerator, Frag Grenades, the grenade enhancing armor, Heart of Flame. The guy is a an incinerator user. That just that just seems appropriate. So let's go with that and give him the grenade. So that that's upgraded now. So that does five damage. We we'll carry two of those around. All right, Basque, welcome to the squad. And Thule, he is really hurt. So we're gonna swap him out as well. Do we do? Do we get Varn in here with his? Uh, this cool silencer? I think we do. And he's got... that. It's a heavy weapon, so he wouldn't have a melee weapon for me to have to swap out. Which one is he using, though? I'm make sure he's got a good one. Ah, look at that. He's got the little... Terrible. Bleed. I can inflict a bleed. Or I can give him this one. Censure. This would be... Oh. This can hobble. Anakin's got a super range upgrade, too. Holy smoke. By the Emperor. Look at that. Man, who's... Okay, so who's got... Thule's got that. So let's... Let's assign... Let's assign Censure to Varn. And get this thing upgraded. Look at this. Okay, for two Poxa Seeds, and we've got 53, so this is good expense. Affliction gains a plus 25% chance to trigger. So the affliction is hobbled. It's already going to go at 25%. So this would be, give it a 50% chance. Boom. Awesome. And then for two Tenterous Seeds, we just picked up a bunch in the last mission. We can upgrade this. The weapon range to 3. Plus 3. So that's going to go to 17. <laughs> With the Purity Seal of Precision... Maybe now I swap that for something, because that's that's great range. So if I get let's see, what what armor do I have? Did I just that's not just what I just went through, so Okay, here we go. So here's the focus armor now. What is he he's wearing right now he's got the Credendo of Will, which ups willpower. A small focus upgrade. And, and... Ooh, immunity to drained. Okay. However, if I go with this one, I can upgrade hit points. Further upgrade focus. This would, like, almost make hobbled a guaranteed effect. So we're going to go with this. We're going to give Vorn the Faith Shield, and we are going to upgrade it fully. 
Let's go with the health. Yes, please. 26 hit points now. Focus upgrade. Watch this go up. Boom. 90% chance to afflict hobbled when he hits with this weapon. And... A max willpower upgrade? Sure. Okay. That's great. Man, we are out of Morbus Seeds, though. That's, that's a drag. We need to collect some of those. We're gonna get a bunch of these guys, though, so... Alright, so... So... Yeah, the... This thing. Do we want to give him something else? Grenade? Maybe? Eh. Grenades only do three damage now. The un... Un... Uh, upgraded ones. We need to get some higher tier grenades. Equipment... Let's see. We could do... We could do that. Give him two extra willpower... We could give him the Artisan Nullifaxer ma Nullifier Matrix. Nullifaxer Matrol is something I was about to say. Let's okay. Let's get, let's stick with the let's stick with the this. He's just going to be a long range silencer user. Okay, so now back to Cadulon, where we were trying to figure out what armor we wanted to give him. This one is now available. Max willpower. Which would be great because that's what he uses to heal. So let's do that. And let's upgrade it. We've got the seeds to spare. Except we're running low very quickly. Because we're burning them. But now he's got 13 willpower to use. So I like it. I like it, I like it. Okay, let's go back to the Teleportarium. Make sure we've got everybody with basic. Nothing, nothing. Yes, okay, this is green, which means we're good to go. How about these? No Prognosticar attuned, so I can't use that slot. However, Torpor... Quicksil yeah, those are, those are good. Do I want to swap? Strike the Spirit. All Knights gain a plus 50% crit chance for a turn. Destroy the Bloom Spawn Spreader. So I could swap for Precision Bombardment. That's an option. I think I'll go with... I think I'll stick with Torpor, though. Okay. Let's rock. Gotta take a class photo. So, level 4 Dolorous. I wonder... Ah, <sighs> Dolorous. So that's the... That is the pain-inflicting strain. So... I wonder what... If that de determines the type of... Enemies will face, or probably the type of mutations they'll have. They'll probably have a lot of damage-inducing enhancements. Well, we're about to find out, so there's no reason in speculating. This hive world is overrun. The Astra Militarum has long since been routed. Nurgle tastes total victory. Let us snatch that morsel from him, eh, Commander? Agreed. All right, so Bloom Spawn Spreader, timed mission. We've got eight turns, so we got to keep an eye out for these rifts. This is blocked off, so we are in a confined area right now. We've got at your command these two, so let's take care of these immediately. Keep an eye out for... Okay, this is a dead-end alley. We have no sense... Oh, we do have an Auspex reading up here. Yes, Commander. Cadulon, close that rift, please. Taking position. All right, I like the hoods for that. 
I sense their presence. Okay, so we've got our first little peak. We've got two. Where is the spreader? Oh gosh. There's two. Okay, so. Oh, nope, there's one over here. Okay, so let's let's go over here to this bloom spawn. This is gonna be probably a Gnarl Maw is the word I'm looking for. So let's get these guys over here. Yes, come on. Take out the Gnarl Maw first. Yes, sir. And let's see where the spreader is. Over there. Way in the far, 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 far back corner. Okay, so probably maybe just do this one spreader. Uh, one bloom spawn, I'm thinking. I don't know. The spreader is the goal. We don't need to worry. The the Gnarl Maws just affect our... Whether or not the spreader has armor. Alright, I don't want to bust the door open just yet because this is... Uh, he's behind. Uh, there are no rifts in this little area that I need to worry about, so we're just gonna... We're gonna come in here, but we're gonna end our turn right now. Uh, do I have these guys shield up? I think so. Let's just shield them up with their last... action. Or I could... I should have maybe overwatched in case those guys come through this door. Oh well. Too late now. Okay, alright, let's... Yeah! Basque will have you come up and we'll have you actually kick in the door because everybody is pretty much in position. Hi, sir. Crowded around. And then everybody will get their actions back. Oh, that's when I should have shielded. What's this? The Emperor's Dogs? Ooh, we got a champion and... Oh. A champion and a, uh... Enemy Terminator. Fight here. Ooh, tough fight. Okay, let's first grab these seeds from this guy. And he is standing right next to an explosive crate, so... Seed extracted. Mask. Cleansing Flame. Target a blast over Area 3 at range 10. Purge 50%. Burning 100% for an infinite number of turns. They'll just burn forever until they die. That's awesome. So what I could do... I wonder if I do this. Battle Toss. Hmm... What's the better use? This, which will damage him, cause this to explode, which will further damage him. I'm hoping if I place it here, the explosion will toss him over here. Then I can come over here and use that cleansing flame and just douse all of these guys. Or, I just hit all three of these dudes. Oh, maybe toss them this way, or at least these two. This guy's immovable, but... Maybe we'll do that instead. And it'll destroy, hopefully, this cover so that the other guys will have a quick shot. I'm hoping. That's that's the plan. Destroyed the entire wall. Wow. Yeah! <laughs> that... <laughs> that is the appropriate response. <laughs> that was amazing. Yeah! Alright. How does this work? Is this a launched thing? Oh, it is. Okay. Inflict burning. Um... Okay, yeah, this is just a willpower special use. Inflict burning. 
Can I get... Nope. We lose range. Okay, so let's do this. Ooh, warp charge to do what? Uh, purge at 100%. Do any of these guys even have... Before I do this... Okay, he's got a mutation. The purging will get rid of that. He's got a mutation. He's got two mutations. Okay, yeah, let's let's go ahead and let's go ahead and do this. Uh, warp charge it for an extra willpower. 100% to purge both of them. Yeah, all of that. let's do it. Boom! Purged. And they're all burning. Outstanding. Okay, good job, dude. Good first salvo. Fire. All right, what we need to do with this guy now? Uh, yeah, we need to run him in. We need to destroy this this thing before before um, they move away from it. So I'm thinking teleport to here. That's awfully close to this guy, though. Let's do it. Even in Let's be bold. Okay, now. So get a kill. And nope, can't quite. Okay, so we're just gonna get these two. Oh, boom. Look at that. The explosion God, almost killed him. Almost. So close. Empty. Okay, empty. So hmm. Psychic suppression. Not necessary. However, let's go ahead and shield him up. No, come on. Okay. Here's where provoke might have some use. If I leave him over here and I provoke, okay, my distance, I'll only get this guy, but He'll beeline, and he won't use... He won't use his, um... Uh... Pew, pew, his shooting weapon, ranged weapon. Wow. It's it's morning. Uh, um, I just woke up recently. That's my excuse. I'm making excuses. So many excuses. So that's the thought. We could do that. Well, come on. That is an option. I am here to serve. I could also... He's got an extra option here, so I could... I could Prometheum Spray to, to here. Provoke this dude. He'll run through the Prometheum Spray because he's he's going to beeline for, for this guy. I would like to get more effect. Uh, you know, this isn't going to actually hit anybody just yet. What about the incinerator? Um, yeah, that's not going to do anything either. Shoot a flame hazard. Spends to burn straight. Yeah, yeah, let's just try this. Let's try this. Alright, set that area on fire. I must re -arm. Now we will provoke him. Uh, warp charge. Yeah, inflict enraged. Warp charge is crazed, so he might attack somebody else. But I want him to run through this Prometheum spray, so we're gonna. So now he is enraged gonna charge unleash me so now we can bring him to here maybe um yeah I 
really love to get rid of this guy. So... If I move him up to here... Yeah, let's do that. Yes. Come on. Because is he still burning, actually? Oh, he is, so he's just going to burn to death. Well, but he burns at the end of his turn, so I would rather eliminate him so that he doesn't do any damage to us. His corpse will feed the maggots. That's a better use, I think. And now... Overwatch... He's got two action points, so he'll shoot twice at this guy as he's coming in. So, let's see if this all pans out the way I think it's going to. The way I have planned. Oh no. He just healed fully. Oh, and he got the sword. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, sweet. Oh, he's going to get a big hit on this guy, though. Unless... Oh, he used his whole action to get there. Uh-oh, he's going to get two swipes. Oh, plagued. Dang, okay. Ooh, and a warp surge already. All oh, right, this is a rank four. Definitely has... No! Oh! Right in the way. Right in the way. Okay, that actually worked. Look at that. He's... This is this is great. This is great. Let's, let's take him out. Force strike. Ooh. Um. Okay, hold the phone. Uh. Swiping will do. What's he got? F seven. So yeah, I don't need to because I can't kill him. Yeah, so I'm not going to force force strike because that's a waste of willpower. Because I can't kill him with it, so. And one more. Dead. Stand. Awesome. Okay. Emperor's Will. Target a knight at any range to gain two willpower. So that is just going to swap two willpower from Chaplain Decran to the target, because it costs two willpower to do. Cagulon. So let's hold on that. Cagulon, you are in the midst of some nastiness here. Fortunately, you've got a, a tiny avenue. Oh, no, you don't. So you're blocked this direction. You can come around this way, though, for... Right, okay, to there. That's where you can go. Or I leave you standing here. Maybe we do that. Warp speed biomancy. Target at night within range one. Okay, so it's got to be up against. Got to stab him in the butt. Okay, let's, uh, let's see. If we, if we daka daka. Hmm. We need to start working on this thing. Let's see. How do we make... How do we do that best? At your command. He's out of ammo, so first move... I have sanctified my round. Uh, he has... Varn has, I believe... Support fire. Yes. So... What we're gonna do. What is your will? Now that he is fully. Can I get you to here, please? And then up to here. Yes, sir. Okay, now you are gonna take a shot. And let's cybolt. What does that do? Uh, da -da 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 -da. Do an extra point of damage, afflict bleed, and an extra crit damage. Okay, so two extra points of damage and afflict bleed. I think this thing is immune to bleed, though, so... We can get him... Oh, man, I don't know. Afflict bleed. Well, actually, 
Why don't we, why don't we see if he's immune to bleed? Immunity to all afflictions. Yep, okay. But we could still do the extra point of damage. So that's what we're gonna do. Lovely. Okay. And we're gonna hit this guy again. Uh, disrupt. What what autos does he have? None. Okay, so there's no point in disrupting. There's nothing to disrupt. Right? And it's gonna flick hobbled, but... Mm. Um... Oh, you know what we need to do? Oh, I can't now. Nuts! Should have healed him, because he's gonna take some hits. Okay, alright. Maybe we use the chaplain. Did I already use the chaplain? No, I've still got an action with him. Maybe I can uh, provoke him. Okay, so let's just, just quit talking, Dan. Just, just shoot this thing. I sir. Okay, and one more. Back, fiend. Excellent. Oh man, it's too bad I can't. Can I do eight points of damage? Okay, so that's not corrupted ground right here? Um, area 3, afflict burning. Yeah, okay, that's not going to do anything. So let's... Alright, let's get him as close as we can. Out order. And... Oh boy, we're just gonna have to reload. Reload it! That's a shame. And we're gonna provoke... This guy. Oh, we don't have the range. Okay. Alright, well, let's run him. Ah, run him. This way. Okay. Advancing. Healed a bit. Oh no. Okay, fortunately he just blinded him. He didn't actually do any physical damage. So now, first order of business, before we forget. Your orders? Like we did last time. Medicaid skull to heal and purify of all afflictions. Ah, don't we just feel better now? My wrath is restored, brother. Okay, now... Shoot. Yes, Commander. Can I move him? Oh boy. Yeah, no, he's right in the middle of this. So what if... Your command. All right, this is a bad, bad place for him to be. Opening fire. Okay, let's get that armor down. Wounds inflicted. Okay. Yeah. We're gonna reload with him because he's empty now. Armed and ready. And we're gonna finish off Cadillon. with this. Right. Not this shot, this is a quarter shot. I must rearm. And with our last action. Oh, he can't quite get there. Nuts. Okay, so let's run him then. 
Finish this guy off. Ooh, maybe not. Ooh, okay. How about we disrupt? That's an option. Because. Okay, well, we're not gonna. You can't parry. Does disrupt do damage? Yeah, it does. Okay. I Affliction resistant. Okay, oh good, now he's hobbled. So now... Can I get him to here? Or is he gonna walk through that? Hmm... Not sure, okay. I am here to serve. Can we... Do that. Set that on fire. For the Emperor! Just barely missed our brother. Woo! Stand in front of a barbecue. Did I miss? <gasps> I think he missed. Oh, poo. Ready to that's, that's not how that was supposed to happen at all. Feel my wrath. Taste my fury! Okay. Now you, sir, would you please get up here and finish this guy with your ranged weapon. This will also trigger a support shot because he's got one more round left. That'll take this thing off. Uh oh. It didn't. Is he out of ammo? Alright, well. Okay. So now these fields of nastiness are still here for two more turns. That's not good. What is your will? Close this. As you will. Okay. Bah. Now let's get. Okay, this is the border right here, so he's he's safe. Anything back here? Yavo, there's a seed pod. Let's go get that. Yes, Commander. Let's see. Can you like hop through the window here? Uh, can you hop through the window here? Maybe here. Let's get some closest. Okay. You over Moving yonder. Swiftly. We're gonna move. Is it worth it? Because where's the spreader from there? Pretty close. Pretty close, but I think. Well, the only reason to go that direction. Well, okay, not the only reason. We'll reduce the armor this thing has. Now we gotta walk him very carefully through this. Oh no, there is no path. Okay, well, so we'll have to go around. What about around there? Nope. Okay. Back to here. And we'll hop through this window. Around. These things are disgusting. These mouthy, they look like sea urchins with nastiness. Alright, bask. Moving now. At one. Okay. Advancing. Let's see. Oh, 
back. Wow! I did not expect that violence. Taking okay, we got a rift here along his path, so we'll make use of that. Um, he is also injured, but I just used up the apothecary's last move, so Praise the Emperor. I'll have to heal him next time. Yes, sir. <laughs> what? Parkour. Uh, let's. Okay, there might be something in there. It's not showing up on the aspects, but sometimes there's no surprise sure. enemies. So let's not. Advancing. Let's not have everybody so spread out before we bust this door down. Okay. What is in here that I might want to make use of? Rifts and such. I'm looking for none. Alright, so we're just gonna bust through here. And just head eh, this way. At once! Yeah. Nothing! I'm shocked that there's nothing in this room. There is a rift, however, and it's sort of on our path, so we will make use of that. We'll get somebody the over there. Ooh, look at all this oil on the ground. I wonder if that burns really hot if you set it aflame. Okay, I don't want to get him too far ahead there either. Varn, can you get over here? No, because I just moved. I am here to serve. Oh, this is it. You're done. This is this is the end of the action. So let's see what's in here. No rifts. Oh, there is a rift. But a second avenue for attack. Ooh, there's a rift there. Maybe that's what we do. Send somebody in that direction. Girl Scout cookies! Nope. Okay. We're safe. Well, we're not safe, but... Warp Surge, what you gonna give me? Might suffer negative one max HP for the remainder of the mission. Darn you, Curse of the Bloom. Okay. Unleash me! Medic. Get over here. It will be done. Close this. Now, do we do we use a skull? Yeah, I'm thinking maybe not. Maybe. Yeah, let's not. Let's put him here. Taking we'll the use. Vision. Battlefield Medicine next turn. Okay, let's get these guys ready to close by. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. What I meant to do is this. Alright, can you get over here and close this? No, you are one space shy. I stand. What a bummer. Okay, this thing we can grab. He can get up here and close this, so let's just go ahead and do As that. Ordered. Give ourselves an extra turn. The extra armor that this bloom spawn spreader is going to have might be a problem, but will be okay. We've got ourselves into this area with lots of extra time, so... Yes, Commander. Moving now. Okay. Anything in here? Nope. There's no reason to go into this room and start trouble.
Yes, sir. Okay, well, that's going to be a problem we're going to have to deal with, too. So maybe we bring everybody in here and then try to avoid that. Maybe, let's see, can you get through this? Yeah. Alright, we're not busting this door down just yet. In fact, we promised ourselves that we were going to battlefield medicine this guy. Actually, let's get him down here Five. first. I clomp, clomp. Yes, Commander. Okay, I think we might have to do it. Yeah, we'll have to do it next turn because we're out. Out of out of range. But it's fine. There's nobody. In in the vicinity. Um, boy, do we do it? Do we do we kick the door down now? Do we? Maybe. Maybe we do. Well, he's all the way over here. I could teleport him next turn. Get him into position. Eight turns. We're okay. Let's let's just wait. Uh, two actions... Yeah, we'll just end the turn. Okay, now... Your command! Medicine. Here now! Gratitude! Okay, now we're gonna shield everybody up. Egypt shields us! What is your will? Move everybody as close as possible. Shield up. As soon as we kick this door down, it's gonna start trouble. Yeah. And shield activate. I have my first combat action with everybody uh, having a shield. At your command. Perfect. The age of shield. Okay, let's move him. Yes, sir. Ooh, look at this. Oh, I can't get it. Again, one one thing shy. Uh, he could use the willpower, so I think we'll, we'll just Moving move down. him to here. That'll trigger. There we go. Ooh. Uh-oh. Oh, wow. Four Plague Marines and a Blight Hauler. Okay. Unstable warp disruption detected. Demons. Nurgle will not give up this ground so easily. Destroy that Bloomspawn now! Yes. Yes, ma'am. Okay, so... What? Alright. Light hauler. Oh no! <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> oh no! Okay, there's two blight hauler. This one, look at this, is right underneath the. Where is it? I can't see it. This. If I can shoot this, it'll explode. Maybe drop onto this thing. But look how much armor he's got. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh boy, he really placed this well. Alright, first first order of bidness is to get this seed out of this guy. Seed excised. Good job. Oh boy. Okay. Um Praise the Emperor. Grab this seed, Moving get him quickly. willpower. Oh, man. This is bad. Oh, there's another guy over here with the seeds. Okay. That's an opportunity. 
Uh, let's see, if we move him to here... Now, is, these guys are going to be behind him. Look at all of this. Look at all of this on the right column. Oh my goodness. Alright, we just need to do bad stuff. How about this? How about we torpor these guys over here? All visible enemies. Oh, that's right! It does all visible enemies. Alright, so we'll just shut everybody down for a turn. Okay, so we will. Do I dare? I could get him to here and Prometheum spray this area. Oh, they're not moving though, so that would be. And the Prometheum spray only lasts a turn, so let's. Let's get him in position. Can he grenade? this thing. Okay, he can talk, toss a grenade here. Toss a grenade there. That would do some damage there, but really we just want to annihilate this thing as fast as possible. So that'll break the armor. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay. Good. And now we will... Do we shield again? Because these guys are really in a bad spot. Actually, let's, let's put them up to here. Alright. Varn. Varn. I think what we'll do with you, good sir, is we will teleport you. To here. We hold that for today. Okay. And you are full on ammo, yes. So we are gonna use support fire activities now. Uh, I guess. Hmm. Well, Ready to start. Let's see. If we do this. We can hit that. Yeah, we can. Uh, yeah, we can damage the the bloom spawn spreader and this knight, plague marine. This is not a knight. How dare I? Is that a good use of that? Seven damage. If I just do a regular shot, and that'll that'll waste his his ammo. Not waste, but it'll use up all of his ammo. So I think maybe we just go with a regular shot here, huh? Okay. First thing we're gonna do though is we're gonna get these supporting fires going. Okay, to there. Uh, we'll have to remember that this guy's over here with these seeds. If this thing lives long enough. Hopefully it won't. But. Okay, shields. Alright, yeah, so I'm just, just going to shoot. Cybolt. Whoa! His Cybolt does three extra damage, so yeah, we're going to Cybolt. Okay, trigger support fire. Okay. And let's, let's do that again. Let's Cybolt this thing as much as we can. Down to eight. I strike true. Brilliant. Brilliant. Uh, Your orders? Doc. Can we get you around the corner here? There we go. Avoid that. On the hunt. Zone. Okay. How are we yeah. doing on armor? Or ammo? We got two. I think he's out of. I think he's only got two uses of support fire. Yeah, two per turn, so that's it for for him. So let's let's whittle this thing down a bit more. Oh wait. Wrong guy. Unleash me. Okay, shoot. 
Let's get it down to five. Cybolt to do an extra point of damage. Yes, please. I'm not messing around. I'm not wasting time. There's too many really scary enemies around. Okay, let's do it. Kill. Dead. Done. Mission over. Excellent work, my brothers. Commander, you have done well today. Awesome. Didn't even have to worry about any of these other guys. That would have been an S show. Because <sighs> those blight haulers, they have armor piercing plasma attacks, and those just kerplow. Bad news. My coffee's empty, so that was an excellent. Oh no! I've got a smidge left! So that's the that's the takeaway with those bloom spawn spreader missions. Get in and just focus all of your attacks on it. Unless you're in a position where you feel like you can um, toy with the other enemies a bit to get some XP for your knights. If you're in a position like I was just in, just surrounded by really powerful enemies, just focus on that spreader. Get it dead because you warp out immediately. All right, so we got two requisitions for doing that. We got an extra requisition point for completing the glorious deed for winning the mission without mastercrafted melee weapons. And we got another requisition for uh, as a mission reward. So great, so we got a total of four. And let's see what we can spend it on. Okay, let's see. A tier five, rank five, just a car. Oh, another Decran. Wow, we got a lot of Decrans in the uh, Gene Seed pool here. Here is a rank tier three. Pallion's Spite Storm Bolter. I don't have, do I have any tier three Storm Bolters? I don't think I do. Even if I did, I can certainly use this. So let's claim that. And here's some tier three power armor. Curious of the Sacrifice. So bonus, two bonus armor, a bonus willpower, plus 10% to focus, plus 10% to resistance. Health can be upgraded an additional two, willpower an additional one, focus an additional 10%, resistance additional 10%. Yes, please, let's take that as well. So we're burning through, we just spent all the requisition we just earned. Plus some. Here is a helmet, enhanced auto senses tier three. This knight gains plus four crit damage for their ranged attacks. Wow, you put that on somebody with auto, no, astral aim? Brutal. Do we grab it? Yeah, let's grab it. Yeah, sure. Two requisition is, is what we've got left, but ooh. Okay, XP, any XP? Yeah, Varn got messed up there, but only one in, uh, one wounded out of all that. No promotions. All right, Decrin, we got you pretty close. Oh, Cadulon, so close. Oh, Varn, 15 points away. Dang. If I'd had him kill the bloom spawn spreader. Yeah, well, anyway. It was a successful mission all around. Now, let's take a little screeny of that. I like that coloring. It's just angry red. Looks like Mars down below. Okay. We've got exc exclamation marks all up and down this. What is. The halo of your Aegis is strong. Are you ready? We have claimed another Reaper. This will be a campaign remembered for millennia. We are making progress, are we not? The task is not complete. We must finish this quickly, or the Inquisitor risks succumbing to the very corruption she holds at bay. Yeah, she looks really under yes, duress. Yes, if you like. How are my brothers faring with this arduous campaign? They will fight unswervingly until our duty is fulfilled and we can return to Titan in glory. Wonderful. Yes, if you like. All right. 
I think, I think he's happy with our Under performance. your guidance, it is a proud day to be a Grey Knight. Excellent. All right, that's all for now, brother. I Avatar. envy our brothers their place on the battlefield, Commander. Manufactorum. What does Lunette have to say? The edicts and machine spirits are silent. I await your input. Another Reaper cast back into the warp. That is satisfactory. <laughs> okay, don't, uh, you know, just please temper your enthusiasm. My servitors have performed a munition audit of your armaments post-mission. There are efficiencies that can be incorporated in your next engagements with the Bloom's Reapers. I will submit our findings to your personal cogitator banks for study. How does the Baleful Edict hold up? Well, I and the ship remain vigilant. That's good. She holds. The lesser machine spirits flit through her systems. They agitate when close to the Reapers. I worry that the corrupting influence of Nurgle will breach the holy circuitry and attack the spirits with the s with scrap code. I and the ship remain vigilant. Okay. Box exchange parameters updated. You and Brother Ektar work in harmony even when you disagree. On the spectral analysis, we are polar opposites. I worship the machine god, and logic is my creed. Brother Ektar is a keeper of the flame. The purity of soul is his purpose. It has been a challenging dichotomy at times. Yet your relationship is companionable. We have grown used to each other. But for the first 3,000 interactions, things were a lot more terse. <laughs> Ektar and I have had 65,782 exchanges. Wow. Well, when your brain is a computer, you can keep track of that type of thing. That would be interesting to know how many conversations or exchanges you have had with everybody you've ever met in your life. Just to have a database of that. Would that be bizarre? Box exchange parameters wow. updated. What's the status of our construction efforts? Halted, by the way. I know the answer to that. Repairs are progressing, Commander. Servitors and components have been allocated. Okay. Praise the Omni Sire. Okay. Proceed. Good. That's all for our now. Our window for communication has concluded. Yeah, we are repairing the Libris right now because it got damaged in our last Death Guard cruiser exchange. As was the uh, Augurium, so we're yeah that one that one battle took a took a toll on us. Vakir, are you all right? Can I help you, Commander? The Reapers, they seem exceptionally debased. All demons carry a flicker of personality from their patron. The Reapers have been chosen for this purpose. Perhaps they are favored by the plague god above all his other children. Yes, let us not waste our time. How do you assess our progress, Inquisitor? God, look at this. Her, oh, poor Vakir. She's uh, uh, just taken a toll. I am impressed, Commander. The hammer falls and the plague god minions scatter. You are worthy of your brotherhood. Should you maintain this level of lethality, you will return to Titan as heroes when we are done. Yes, let us not waste our time. Okay, that's all for now. Enough for now. The bloom festers. All right, we've got two prime seeds here now. I really am surprised that this one isn't pink. Because this was the tent Tenterous seed, I think it was. I think that's a, that was a, a missed, missed opportunity there. That they didn't, that the color of the fluid here does not match the color of the seed. All right, Libris Malleus will be done in one day. We've got some injured uh, uh, knights that need some tending to. She's vexed for 33 days because she's upset that I gave away two of our... Grimoires to the Grand Master. So we'll continue our travels. There aren't any missions that we can reach right now, so we're just going to tool around the center of the sector until something comes up. The Libris is now complete. Wonderful. Start a new project. Actually, we can't because we don't have the Servitors. But what we want to do is this. Only four Servitors. Okay, so in five days we'll generate another Servitor that we can use, so... 
that will be good. So we'll just keep keep moving. All right, high sanctuary project complete. Normally, an aura of sanctuary is limited to the user and their immediate area, but I have uncovered several methods that purport to extend such psionics over thousands of meters. These estimations have been authored clearly by the unambitious. I am confident that with your brother's assistance on the ground, I can propel the sanctuary from far greater distances. Cool! All right, well now that this Libris is repaired, we can continue work. Okay, that was... What did I just complete? This one. High Sanctuary. So do we go with... Plus one stratagem slot. Okay. Uh, mass Purification. All Knights Purify and Heal. Affected Knights lose their afflictions. Great. Three Poxus Seeds to complete that. Could also spend three Tenterous Seeds for Bloom Excision. Target a Blast over Area 4 to purge 100%. Afflicted, lose all mutations. Okay, so that is something that we will use on enemies. Blast Area 4. This affects all Knights regardless of where they are. So maybe we go with that. Maybe we go with that. This will take 11 days. Tide of Shadows, 100% resistance for three turns. And purifies. Ooh. So that purifies, boosts resistance for three turns. This one would heal and purify. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. What's this down here? Dominate. For three turns. Okay. That could be useful as well. What are these? Reflective insight. Come to admire the Grey Knights. Extraordinary resilience. They're competent psychers, but I believe some of their power is grounded in your chapter's rights and sacraments. Power I might turn to better sustain my supportive efforts in battle. So this would gain me a stratagem. Why does it say times two? Reflective insight one. Reflective insight two. They all take one. They both take one. Seed. This one is just five and a stratagem slot. What? What? I thought we could only have four stratagems. Are you telling me that there are even more available? Or once we get this one, this one, or this one, then that's it? That's scary. Oh, now we can now we can find a, another Reaper. I think we do that. What do we have the fewest of? Besides Morbus. Oh, Necrosis. That's Necrosis. Which one of these is Morbus? Mortus. Uh huh. I've been saying it wrong all this time. Okay, but this one. This one, this one. Nine days. Let's do it. Let's do it. Now that now that the they are not forbidden knowledge anymore. Okay, good. Goody gumdrops. Let's continue our travel. Oh, here we go. We've got our fourth. Now we can start repairing this, please, yes, six days, and we're done. So let's, let's see. Oh boy, we've got three cruisers. Is there any way to tell how strong they are? Can I like, can I boop on them? Nope, that just takes me to the planet. Okay, well... Tell you what, we're just going to advance time then. Gurion. Oh! I hear good news, Commander. Another Reaper sent screaming back to the war. Yes! It seems your elevation was not unfounded. The edict remains capable of decisive action under your leadership. Trust me, Grandmaster. I know what I'm doing here, man. Okay, high support. Which means, which means what? High support. Extra requisition, maybe? Uh, we don't know, okay, so Algerian will be done in two days. Let's continue, continue parking it here. Actually, let's come here. No, let's go over here. 
Augurium is now repaired. Wonderful. But we can't build anything. So let's keep... Oh man, I don't like these guys just parked here. I thought they would go somewhere. Now that we are repaired, do we try to take one of these guys out? Oh, here he comes. Okay, now we'll come this way, since he's coming down this path. We'll just avoid. Oh, intervention. Commander, the tech priest has informed me of an anomaly picked up within the warp storms in this sector. Okay. It carries a psychic signature connecting it to the blue. We should investigate. Okay, she got very upset when we didn't make it to this last time. So, I guess we just go here. We'll, we'll do it. I wish that we could... What do we want to build? We want the... We want this. The enhanced Geller field, but we don't have the servitors for it, but that's probably going to be our next project, so that we can come into Warp Storms without suffering. The Baleful Edict does not enjoy swimming in a Warp Storm, and I don't believe her. Don't uh, blame her. What's happening? Oh, has she located uh, the next Reaper already? Is that... That was fast. Oh boy. That's a cool shot. Oh, that's an even cooler shot. Oh. Let's take a couple of those. Through the void. A wind of putrid spores. I... A trillion innocents doomed with every breath. I did what was necessary. The Reaper's course emanates before me. We must resume the hunt. Oh, I am so concerned about Inquisitor Vakir. Wow. Unless she just went really heavy on the eyeshadow, she is really suffering. All right. Reaper location detected. Malathian the Harvester. Look at this guy. Look at this bloated, disgusting. The Codex reeks of death, a byproduct of its attunement to the Mortis strain. Even I can feel the Codex wearing at my will, but I buoy my spirit with an hourly recite recitation of the Litany Majoris. And I have recommended to Ektar that your knights do the same. Soon, they will need all the strength their faith can offer. Gulp. Okay, well, he is... ...right here, so we'll... ...we'll do this... ...first. Actually, let's get, let's get another project going. Have we... we've never seen Vakir sit down before. Like, that's... that's how... ...that's how under it she is. Poor kid. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. 15 days. And she's still vexed for 21 days, so... Oh, 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 four new missions. Holy... Oh. Dear me. Okay, one of them's right next door. One of them's over here. Two of them are way back here. Okay, that's level two going to three. This is level two going to three. This is level one going to two. And this is level zero going to one. Okay, so not too bad. Not too bad. I'm not going to be able to make it to those unless I leave now. But we're not going to because we need to do this. So probably what we'll be able to do is take care of whatever this is unless it makes us sit too long and then we'll maybe check out one of these and then go for our buddy over here except we don't want to take this on while this Death Guard cruiser is in orbit over that planet because it'll 
probably affect us. All right, let's see what this is. Warp Storm. The Mock. Commander, the Warp Storm temporarily overloaded the ship Skeller field. No. Demonic incursions have occurred on multiple decks. No. With our brothers sustaining significant injuries in the process. Uh oh. Three knights wounded. But. Okay, continue travel. Okay, let's see what this is. What is this foul aberration? A massive tower of some kind, extending as far as planetary orbit. Wow. What is it made of? Space Analysis. elevator. The material is fungoid. Structural composition is hive-like. Bloom patterns are certain. A new vessel for spreading corruption. Uh oh. It must be destroyed. Agreed. For once I agree with the Inquisitor. Warning. Defensive capacity unknown. Heat dissipation patterns could indicate ionic shielding or stellar weapons capacity. <sighs> we do not really know what we're dealing with here, Commander. Under the circumstances, we could contact Grandmaster Kai for approval of emergency exterminators. I can't. I don't have I didn't I don't have any exterminatus. Constructed. I don't have that. Unless they're saying they'll Titan will send a ship to do it. Bypass the hive, the bloom will spread. Absolutely not. Not an option. Send four knights to destroy it. Four knights will be at some risk. Hiccup, excuse me. Open fire on the hive. The ship may be at great risk. Ugh. Oh. Or request emergency exterminatus. This will take time and cost esteem with Titan. <sighs> if I send the knights to destroy it, it says they'll be at some risk, so there'll be there'll be some wounds. I've already got three that suffered wounds just getting here. Does that mean they're gonna be... I'm gonna have a bunch of wounded knights? You know what? That's what we're here for, though. We are the Emperor's hammer in the face of demonic incursion. So we're, we're going in. Lock and load. At once, Commander. Our knights teleported to the Hive, but encountered an army of Nurgle's minions. They have destroyed it, but suffered significant wounds in the process. So, Estros and Rugen are wounded. Storm, Cadulon have light wounds. Not as bad as I thought that could have been. No criticals. And no fatalities. What did we get out of that? Anything? I don't think we got anything out of that. No, uh, no boost. No removal of Vakir's vexed status. Yep, all we got is just a, a bunch of injuries that'll take two weeks to, to heal. Alright, well, no, no servitors. Nothing, huh? Alright, well... What if we come over here? Well, let's I can see it's this one. What's our reward? Hey, servitors. Ooh, oh. Hang on. Level one corruption. Dolorous seeds. We need Necrosis seeds. There's a Hellbrute. Plague champion. We need we need Necrosis seeds. Win a mission without using servo skulls. Are you kidding? I live on servo skulls. Oh, well, here's some necrosis here, too. Oh, also 15 servitors. Okay. Win a mission without using servo skulls. All right, both of these want me to win the mission without using servo skulls. If I go here. Yeah, that all. So I can do one or the other. If I come here. Is there a chance I could do both? 
I don't think so. I don't think I could make it to here if I just come here. So I think we'll take this one because we need the we need the necrosis seeds. And there's necrosis seeds here too. Yep. That's what we're doing. That is what we're doing. Okay. Get there just in time. Huh. <sighs> wow. And here, in orbit over Spirus 2, is where we will conclude this episode. Battle Brethren, thank you so much for joining me for this one. Please like and subscribe. I would love that. I'm, I get I get happy every time I see. <laughs> anyway, like and subscribe. Hit the bell for a notification for future episodes. Leave a comment down below if you are playing this game and have any tips for me. Until then, I will see you next time. That's uh, until then. That's a, that's a swap. The, anyway, enjoy your day. Thank you so much for watching. Oh, yeah.